what's the best fisherman? Is the best fisherman the one that makes the most money? Is the best fisherman the one that catches the most fish? Is the best fisherman the one that catches the biggest fish? To me, the best fisherman is the one that has the best fish. It's a stunning landscape. The watershed is one of the most uh, healthy salmon watersheds in all of North America. Most watersheds can only handle one or two species of salmon. The Taku has all five species of salmon. What that means for our fishery is that we can provide commercially viable salmon, sustainably harvested, for five to six months out of the year. There's almost no other river system that you can do that. The inlet itself is stunning, absolutely stunning. I love the quote, the silence is deafening. We want people to taste the smell of Alaska, the fresh ocean air, the stillness, to be humbled by the quality of what, what is here. What Taka River Reds does differently on the boats is everything to the fish. By proper handling, making sure that the fish are not bound by gravity, rapid chilling, getting the blood out is key, and we do that with a hypodermic needle, and we actually pump the blood out within moments of the fish coming on board. It's the blood that makes fish taste fishy. It's not the meat, it's just the blood. So we want to get the blood out before it coagulates, deep inside the capillaries. I want you to taste a sockeye. I want you to taste a coho. I want you to taste a king and know the difference. And you can tell that by removing the blood. We've always felt like our fish uh, is of the highest quality because we're doing everything we know of to preserve that quality. But uh, that's all subjective. To have a scientist use a machine that objectively tells us those numbers and says, yes, you're doing the right thing with this fish is, is really very cool. Everything else we do is for the health of salmon fisheries. Over the years, our habitat conservation efforts at Taku River Reds have become just as important as the fishing and the processing and the handling of the fish. Nobody here wants to catch the last fish. It's too scary to think of the other options, that what we have today might not be around in a very near future if we don't take care of it and protect it. There are no employees, it's just the six of us. We're a group of fishermen and fishing families. What it means to us is not just being able to eat the finest fish on the planet, but when you fish for your family, the goal isn't really to the pocketbook. It's about fishing for the future. You're just not making a living. We're, we're doing things that, that touch people in a certain way because they, they're getting a piece of Alaska. They're getting something that they know is the highest quality. They're supporting our way of life, our fishermen's way of life. There's a lot more beyond just going to the store and buying something to eat.